So I'm standing at the corner of Frischman and Hayar Khon in Tel Aviv. There's the beach over there. I was waiting to meet a friend. And uh, I don't see the place she was talking about. She said there's a good pub outside and they have a bomb shelter. Uh, I think she said ask for the table near the bomb shelter. Uh, so that's interesting. That's, you know, what do you, what you look for in a, in a restaurant or a pub in Tel Aviv? Do you have a nice bomb shelter? In Toronto, it's like, do you have a, you know, a nice patio? Or, uh, you know, is your French onion soup good? And uh, just seconds ago, there was a big boom. And I was, you know, for a second, I'm like, is that like a car backing up or something? Like, or whatever you call that when the engine goes poof. But uh, no, it was a missile interception. Because a Facebook friend literally just messaged me seconds ago and said, oh, did, you know, I can see the interceptions from my porch. Did you hear that one? That was a loud one. And it sounds kind of like when you hear fireworks in Toronto, boom. It's like, oh, there's fireworks somewhere going off. That's nice. But here, there's missiles being launched from Gaza that are just indiscriminately trying to kill any Jew uh, they can hit. I don't think people in North America quite understand what that's like. Uh, you know, they can say, oh, the, the, the poor Arabs. Uh, I, it's, it's just insane to me. Like, in a heartbeat, if the missiles stopped being launched here, the Israelis would stop fighting back. They wouldn't have to fight back, and that would be it. There would be peace. Nobody would be killed. But there's crazy militant terrorists just shooting missiles over, and the only reason they're not killing anybody uh, there's my friend. The only reason they're, they're, they're not killing people is because Israel has spent so much on their technology that they can somehow shoot missiles down. Uh, but that doesn't mean that, oh, see, we shouldn't be defending ourselves and, and stopping the missiles. Like, it's just madness. I'm just making a video about Israel. This is Janice. Okay. She's uh, camera shy, or maybe she's in Mossad. We don't know.